Okay, so the last way for the student to upload a complex scenario to you is the advanced uploading of files. Files, not file. So this is the only feature different between file and files is it's plural. Ah, uh, and boy. And three, topic one. There we go. Okay, description. With a picture. Okay, so you can have them upload many, 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 many things. Okay, and here we go. Uh, again, grade, yep, disable this. Oh, no. Maximum size per file. Again, I'm li very limited to two megs. Later on, I'll show you how to get ar around this. Maybe you have to upload something like 100 megs. I got a different way of doing that using an offline activity and adding maybe a shared folder on your hard drive. Okay, allow deleting, yes. Maximum number to out upload, shoot, let's say 17. Allow notes, yes. Okay, I don't wanna hide the description. The description just states the description of that file and why it's there. Again, here's my email, visible groups, and show. Save changes. And here we go. So the student is now going to upload, let's say the student example. He's also going to upload a picture. And there we go. That's the difference. And now you, the student can actually go in here and delete it too. Going to send for marking, and yes. Marking just basically states that it is now going to go into media into the student's grades. And then you can go in and grade it. Remember, this whole time I'm still logged in as me, not the student. So actually the student hasn't done any of his homework. I've just been giving him grades for it. Okay, so there we go. Um, if now we have to cover a little bit different things like uh, a quiz and a forum. All right, on to the next video.